Good morning. How you doing? Great, Coach. Uh, as always, thank you so much for taking some time to join us. If you could please start us out with an opening statement, recapping your team's most recent outing versus Austin P. Yeah, Austin P. came to us. Uh, uh, we knew they had a, a good team. Uh, they were number twenty-one ranked team in uh, FCS football uh, in, the, in the top twenty-five, and uh, uh, so we knew we would have a hands full, and uh, we competed. You know, uh, we played very well uh, in the first half, and. Uh, Again, this week it was seven to three at halftime, and uh, the defense was playing great, and uh, offense kind of sputtered. We moved the ball at will. We only punted the ball one time in the first half, and uh, we just and when we got down to the red zone and got close, we would make a mistake, shoot ourselves in the foot, and cost us. And I wasn't able to take take advantage of field position. Uh, they got the opening kickoff, took it. They got a first down, got to midfield, and they went for it on fourth down. And we got a big stop right there at midfield and come out and uh, we run the ball and get a personal foul. Back us up 15 yards and kill that drive. And uh, we should have took advantage of that opportunity and take that ball down and get some points out of it. And we didn't. And that's kind of the way we played the game on offense. We just, every time we had an opportunity, we would do something to uh, shoot ourselves in the foot. And, uh, at the end of the day, they, they made a couple more plays than we did. So I take hats off to them. They well coached. They played hard, and uh, we had we got to go to the go to the film, watch it, uh, learn from it, and uh, move on. We start conference this week, so um, we got to be ready. Appreciate those comments, Coach. We'll now open up for questions for Coach Maynard. First question goes to Dr. Cavill. Doc Cavill's inside the HBC Sports Lab. Good morning, Coach Maynard. Good morning, Doc. How you doing? I'm doing well. Obviously, we think about you oftentimes in terms of what you do offensively, uh, but you overhauled the defense and um, played really solid in a lot of ways on the defensive side of the ball. Talk a little bit about some of the standouts on that side of the ball, what they were able to get done to give your offense a chance uh, in staying in the game for most of the game until late. All those guys are, are flying around making plays. Um, Hayes, uh, Zerion Hayes, uh, defense end is making plays. Charles Bell in the secondary is making plays. Uh, all those guys are flying around. We got linebacks making plays. Got guys in the secondary making plays. Um, it's a team effort. Uh, it starts up front. We get some pressure. And uh, those guys just flying around having fun. Uh, we just got to do a better job, like you said, on the offensive side of the ball of uh, taking advantage of some of these turnovers and field position they give us to get that ball in the end zone. Turning to a uh, conference game. As you get into conference play, you travel down you know, on the road, Tallahassee last year, classic matchup. Uh, they came from behind, obviously new team, different framework this year, but what are your thoughts in terms of the matchup after looking at FAMU thus far this season? Uh, I think it's going to be a great matchup. I mean, we're in conference play now. Um, um, every week it's going to be it's going to be exciting, uh, competitive games, and I don't see this one being any different. Uh, we know how hard we all know how hard it is to go down to Dope Stadium and uh, and win in Tallahassee, and then you got Coach Simmons uh, always doing a great job. His team is always prepared. They're going to play hard, and then they got that 12th man, that crowd, and of course they got the band. So, uh, you know, we got to go out. We got to go down and play well this week. Uh, all three phases: offense, defense, and special teams, and uh, it's going to be tough, but we look forward to the challenge, and uh, I think it's going to be a great football game. Look forward to catching on ESPN Plus. Should be a good matchup. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. Next question goes to Zach McKinnell. How you doing, Coach? Zach McKinnell from the Blue Bloods. Good, Zach. How you doing? Not too bad. Um, I want to talk a little bit about quarterback play. Uh, can you speak a little bit about, um, you know, are you guys going to open back up the QB battle, and who do you expect to take the first snaps this weekend against Florida A&M? Yeah, it's uh, we're gonna practice them both again, and uh, see how they practice and uh, evaluate it, and who we think gonna give us the best chance to win. That's where we're gonna start. And uh, that guy's playing well. He's staying there. If he's not, we might have to make a change uh, because nobody's just seeming to willingly want to just take the job and run with it, and um, they keep going back and forth. So we gotta let them compete again, and and we'll see what happens. Thank you, Coach. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. Currently taking questions for Coach Maynard, Alabama A&M.
Any more questions for Coach Maynard with Alabama a &M? Coach, as always, we appreciate your time. We look forward to speak with you again next week. Thank you.